Got Cali Mick. What it do, man? It's Cali Mick, and I'm tapped in with Nola Culture, baby. Let's yeah. get it. Because I had just finished, like, really listening to that uh, Long Live Meet You. you yeah, know what yeah, saying? yeah. That shit dope, like, you know what I mean? Appreciate it, baby. But, like, I was thinking, like, why that title? Because I was like, you know, who was Meet You to you? Because you wouldn't just name, you know, your project out right. of somebody unless that was, you know. So, Meet You, Meet You, like, my brother, my big brother on some hood shit. We not blood related, but we related. You know, he watched me grow up, teach me the ropes and shit coming up in the hood. My brother got killed for wrongfully dead, like, you know, uh, wrong person at the wrong. Basically, he was at the wrong place at the wrong time, you know what I mean? And shit, you know, you know how that go. Been as good to the cab, but yeah, that's my brother, man. Long live meet you. We come out together, like, yeah, hi. Right. That was the same three stands for Cali you hear me? Third all right. Uh, all right. Cali Omic, but for the most part, long live meet you, man. I right. love my brother to some bullshit. Right. Yeah. Sorry for your loss, brother. Yeah. yeah. Um, can't relate, you know, when, like when I listen to that, you know, that bit dope too. But like it seems like it's like personal, you know, like is it like someone in particular you want to feel that song? Man, I want the world to feel it. Like right. I want you to know that you and and, and, and somebody, y'all it's no two people the same. Right. You may think a lot, y'all might have similarities, but we we're not the same. Like, right. you know what I'm saying? I can't relate. Like some shit right. you done, I can't relate to it. The bitch ass shit you done, I can't relate to it. Yeah, only can yeah. relate to what I can relate to what I feel like real shit, you know what I'm saying? Right. But it wasn't all my music is personal. All of it is personal, but it wasn't directly personal to nobody. It was for the world. I want you to feel how I feel. Like man, you are not saying we can't relate. Right. You know what I'm saying? We on two different levels. Like you still stuck on this lane. I didn't got in a, I'm like, I'm in a fast lane. I'm trying to go to the next level. I'm trying right. to build. I'm trying to grow, you know what I'm saying? Right, right. Thanks. So like Cause I saw y'all, uh, you and Bub and Vaughn like on a uh, video together. I would think we all uh, from the same part of the Calio. Yeah, we all from the Calio. Vaughn from back of town. Me and Bub, we from front of town, same driveway. Right. Yeah, you know saying. Rest in peace, Slam his uncle, Calio landlord. Right, right. Yeah, you know saying we all yeah. come up under the same rules. You hear me? But Vaughn, shout out Vaughn hood stuff. At back of town, shout out to the whole Calio. Right. You know OTC Calio Free Mall. Uh, but Vaughn from back of town, we from front of town, you know, but it's all one, you know what I mean? So like, talking about like the front of town and back of town, like can you talk about the tension between front of town and back of town, okay, like when the bricks were still up though? Man, some of that shit though was before my time, during my time and after my time, like right. some shit you can't speak on, some shit you can't speak on, but it, 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 it's really not my business because it wasn't involved in me, like for the tension, like, right. but Everything cold instead of everything cold, you know, so we we not even looking back at the past. Right? I mean, we trying to build forward right. as one unit and keep going, you know what I'm saying? That's a fucking blessing, because it's crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. Real crazy, yeah. you know what I'm saying? The crazy part about yeah. it, it always be envious and jealousy or uh, miscommunication. If niggas have sit down and have a conversation, right. a lot of shit will be dissolved, you know what I mean? If niggas sit down yeah. and have a conversation, that's all. Really it take two saying. minutes to have a conversation. For real communication, though, for real. Yeah. Mm. On that toxic relationship, on that toxic, that you know toxic know I, mean? that, yeah. <laughs> I like that bitch that too. Love, yeah. Yeah. Like, man, like, what I want, like, what advice could you give a nigga that's like in a toxic relationship? Yeah, there's, right? no <laughs> <laughs> there's no advice I can give a nigga in a toxic relationship. Right, man. Man, that shit that right. So look at the advice I can give a nigga in a toxic relationship. And shut the fuck up and just keep on going. If you gonna fuck with her, fuck with her. If not. Right. Get the fuck from out because these hoes, boy, these bitches in New Orleans, boy, these bitches make you want to shoot them with their mouth, bitch, on the tank. For real, I know that boy, man, that shit is, yeah. Man, these hoes, but I love her, though, you hear me? Yeah, I wrote All that by right, my BM. I didn't really write it because I, you know, I, I, just, I, don't, I just record, but right. she had pissed me off probably some shit. And I was, I jost all day, so I probably was josting and the beat was playing. That shit just came up, man. 
I just express some shit like, you know what I'm saying? Keep on flashing out your top, you got me fucked up, yeah. Right. Keep on thinking I want a nigga to play with, you got me fucked up. Like, you know, you know how to move with him, man. Right. But you know, I ain't trying to go on that type of time, you know, a nigga like, you know, you're just speaking, you know what I mean? Speaking true facts, you know, but that's how the song came about. But for the advice, I can't give a nigga no advice because I ain't good myself. I ain't right my motherfucking self. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, I, I'm sitting there acting like I'm asking for the right answer for myself. <laughs> <laughs> just, just, just enjoy while it's good, you hear me? But I can't get no man fuck no. I ain't got no advice to nobody in relationship. Don't listen to me, you gonna end up fucked up, brother. Right, <laughs> the best the, the best the best advice is experience. Go through it, live through it, experience it, and learn from it, you hear me? That's the best advice I could give you. That's real shit dude. Right. In the post, you know, you said somebody was a real clown. Yeah. Oh, you talking about the clown that nigga, right, man. Right. That post let me tell y'all, look up. Nigga know me, man. I don't sugarcoat nothing. Anything I feel once, I'm going to feel it twice. That post was for anybody with an Instagram login. Right. Anybody with a social security number. That's right. what that was for, you know what I mean? Right. So if you feel like it was for you, your shoe, that shoe fit, Put that wear that bitch on. <laughs> you know what I mean? But I mean that shit, though. Like, think about it, though. You could be around somebody, you know what I mean? And niggas are laughing your motherfucking face. I done seen it, you hear me? Nigga come around, nigga laughing their face, you hear me? Fucking Kiki man. like it's all cool. And the minute nigga walk off, you start talking about the man. Uh, right. You were probably talking about the man, man. Walk up, you start so, you know what I'm saying? I got to, you know, like, uh, yeah, put me in the room with the same nigga was talking about me. I bet he be dick pulling. I yeah. guarantee you. <laughs> yeah, because I'm going to stand on mine. Thanks, yeah, we're going to get that business clear. We're going to stand on that nation business, you understand? Right. But that's what I mean. Like, that's, that, that post for anybody with a social security number. Or uh, Instagram login. Now take it how you want to take it, yeah, but right. it is what it is. Mm. Nah. Can you tell me, like, what you see in the future? For you? Like, what's in the future for Cali and me? Oh, man. In the future, we got a whole bunch of shit, man. I got, uh, I got a project done already. I ain't got no title for it yet. I'm still right. drilling on the title. But I got a project done. Matter of fact, I'm going to give you some new music so you can play in the background with the shit or uh, whatever. But I got a I got a project coming. I got I got two videos that I ain't released yet. I got that crunch time with me and Cali above. I got that how you living with me and international T. Right, you hear me? Right. So I got them two videos Tuck, I got Toxic Love video shoot coming. I'm waiting on my director to give me a day. Shout out Boss Man Jungle. You hear me? Global, we out in this thing. Right. Uh, after that, I got another one. The song, one of the songs I'm gonna give you. I got, I got. Matter of fact, I got two videos. I'm just waiting on a date for my uh, team. Right. So, yeah, I, I got a whole bunch of shit, man. We got. Uh, I got another project I'm about to do with Jungle, with, with my director. Yeah, my director rap. Right. Yeah, you know I man. He got a name for it, but we ain't we ain't really confirmed on it. So I don't want to get a word. You know, I don't want to put too much out there, and they be looking for that shit, and then they ain't really what that is. So, I got I got a project done. I got a project on the way with Bald Man Jungle, Film Three Global shit. Yeah, and I'm about to bring my little brother back out, you hear me? The Mooch Man. Yeah, yeah, yeah Sam right, three man. shit. Yeah. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, stop playing. Yeah, he, he, you know, it, it's up there. With, I got some shit in store for y'all. Please believe me. Right, Please right. fucking believe it, man. Right. man. And I'm looking for a little youngster. I can take my time, put my time behind, you hear me? And, and, and build. Like, I got I got a, I got a Sam three chain for somebody. Right. Yeah. Serious shit though. That's how we coming in the future, bro. And that just that just minor shit. Like that ain't even the half of it. You know what I'm saying? Right. Got I got a, I got a, uh, another clothing line coming with my son and my daughter. Yeah. For them. So you know I'm I'm building I'm building and growing. If you ain't growing and building, you could go here about your business. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, and that's what we is. doing. Real, so that's good, though. I ain't lying. It's, it, it's good to see a, a nigga like this moving, right. going forward, though, for real, son. Facts. Seeing too many people like fall back and then Man. fall low. So like, the thing is, though, the crazy part about it, bro, I was one of them people that fell back and probably fell off. Like a lot of right. people probably didn't feel like that, but when I was rapping and shit before, you know, long before I had stopped. And started making beats and producing for INC for Cali Above and shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? And it, it worked hand in hand for both of us because he needed a producer and I needed exposure. So, you know, we did what we did. Mm. And, you know, it worked for both of us. But I just started back. I just jumped back into rapping and shit probably a year ago. You remember when I dropped the Glass House project? Yeah. You go check that out. It's on I was, yeah, and I shit. Just, um, and then I come back and hit him with the Long Love Nietzsche. Like I said, I got another. Dope. I got the, you know what I mean? The two singles off there with Fendi Pete with J Life. Yeah. International T with Vamp Life. You know what I'm saying? 
Shout out to 730 Dip. And, uh, shit, you know, we about to keep stepping, man. We're going to keep stepping, man. You know what I'm saying? Right. And we're going to keep marching until we get to the top, you know, until we do what we got to do. That's what all, that's all I can say, you know what I'm saying? That's all, I can, that's all my focus is, is to keep marching, baby. Right. So, like, for, like, the artists that's, like, trying to come up and stuff, can you tell them how important it is to have a team? Because a lot of people be thinking they can just really do it on their own, like, like, well, do you think it's possible to do it on your own, or do you think you need that team? <coughs> Anything is possible, bro. Right. I don't take that from nobody, bro. Yeah. Cause I was one of them niggas that was thinking like, oh, I'm gonna do everything on my own. I don't need nobody. Which you gonna need somebody as a motherfucker. Like it's something you can't do. The next man can do. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Whether you paying for your service or y'all or y'all swapping workout, it's always you gonna need a team. And I got a team. You understand? Know Shout out to Straight N T V, Joe P, my brother. You understand? Know he do a lot of media work and shit or whatever. A lot of digital graphic work and all that for me. Right. I right. got. That's I got my, my, my video people, that, you know, my director and shit, Boss Man, Family Focus Film, Jungle and them, shooting a video and shit. One shot, shot a couple of my videos too. Uh, I, I pretty much record and, you know, engineer myself, but I have I also have a personal engineer. Right. Shout out Titan. Uh, like, it, it's, it's a bunch of shit behind the scenes, a lot of shit that, you know, that y'all just don't see. Like, because really? at the end of the day, all you get is the finished product, you know right. what I'm saying? So yeah. that and that's what that's the full focus on making sure the finished product is what we want. Right. But you, you gonna need a team like whether, cause you can't shoot your own video. You can't you can't shoot a video and you gotta be behind the camera and in front. Of that bitch, I tried it. It's hard. You <laughs> wanna go get one angle? <laughs> <laughs> I tried it. Really? You know what I'm saying? Like they did the way the world set up now. You can record yourself, so they didn't make that easy for you, but. One engineer might hear something that you ain't hear that it might be, you know, a little, it's just a, a tweak to make the sound sound good. You know right. what I'm saying? Managing, like, dealing with people. Like, I got a bad attitude, you hear me, without my manager and all that shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? Right. I was, you know, a lot of shit, a lot of deals, a lot of shit went go through because I might not even have an attitude. It might just sound, it might just sound like that because of the way I talk, you know what right. I'm saying? So. You, you need a team, man. You need a team, man. You need more support from your girl, your family, and everything, dog. Fucking right. Support from your family is big. People like, you don't need family support, but that that's the that's the first people that's going to hear your product. That's the first people that's going to, you know, I'd rather, I'd rather my family keep it real. I can take it from them. I got, know they could, you know, I know they ain't going to bullshit me like, oh, no, this bitch wax on this shit. Right. Most niggas, like, oh, every, everything fire. Like, I'm, you know, right, right, some niggas right. you meet, they ain't nothing never whack to them because they, they don't know how to tell the truth. You right. know what I'm saying? You got to tell the truth. And right. I feel like family, people you've been around, they'll give it to you raw, not cut before anybody. So, right. you know what I'm saying? They part of the team, too. You need that support. You know what I'm saying? But other than that, man, just keep your mental straight. And, and, and make sure your team good, like you know what I'm saying. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you, you give what you take. You know what I'm saying. You take what you give. You hear me? So yeah. that's how that shit go. It work hand in hand, but um, you need a team. Ain't no such thing as doing this shit by yourself. Ain't no such thing as doing this shit without no bread. Ain't no such thing as getting this shit done without. You know what I'm saying. You need, you gotta have that. Yeah, that team that support. You gotta have people that's willing to sacrifice. Their personal time for your dream who believe in you like because right. if not it, it ain't gonna work like it, 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 it's always gonna be a time issue it's always gonna be something coming up it's always gonna yeah I whoever think, a like, part of your team gotta believe in you more than you i think like a team like as long as you got a uh if you got a strong team everybody just can keep it real and like you know keep it real with themselves know they part know what they're strong the about the thing about with me when building the team you gotta get some. You gotta get people to. You gotta get them do things they would like to do. Right. I can't get you to be doing passing out passing out posters and you don't like to promote. Right. You know what I'm saying? So that's the key. You gotta make people feel important. You gotta make them feel appreciated and grateful. You know what I'm saying? Like you gotta be grateful for them. Even though not make them feel like you gotta really be appreciative and grateful for these people. You know what I'm saying? So that's just what it is. Like as long as your team feel like, you know. Appreciative and grateful, take care of them, treat them to some smart, the smart thing. Maybe right. lunch, lunch, my, you know, anything, just make them feel appreciated, man. Right. And, and that's what it is, right there, man. But you need a team, like, like you said, everybody do their part. Right. Everything runs smooth, you know what I'm saying? Put that grind there, everybody go above and beyond for for themselves and for you. 
Yeah. You can't lose with nothing like that, man. You can't yeah. lose with nothing. Well, like I think, that. I think a lot. That's what a lot of people feel of and pride and shit. Like you know, niggas be feeling pretty cause they like right. they want to be the star. They want rap and all that shit. Like you can't rap. Yeah, we the big beef and some yeah, shit. Yeah, like you know what I'm saying. We done been through that. I done been through that son. Right. We done been through the weather. I done been through the storm. Like we had a lay, you know, straight shot. Bunch of friends. Everybody was in with us. It was straight shot entertainment. The same shit I spent off all the screening TV. Right. You know what I'm saying? So, and a lot of niggas was with us. A lot of people were with us. All family, all brothers and sisters and shit. But it was a lot of ego and a lot of this and a lot of that. And I won't be this and I won't be that. And shit that ain't even even really real positions right now. Niggas talking about being president and CEO. Right. But don't want to put up a dollar. Like, come on, you a president, really? you want to be a CEO, really? you got to put the bread up. But really? he just going off a title and a name. Going through that shit. So, Nigga that, well, nigga that been that done that like <laughs> and yeah, I understand it now, you hear me? So right. when you build a team, like I said, you build a team, you gotta build a team off of bam, like say how you like the video algorithm, you'll be the video algorithm, man. Cause you like the you know, this what you do. You you in a, you know, we gonna you know, we're gonna use him, all right. Not usual, but you know, use you for your ability. Like oh, we gonna you gonna get all the all the shit in the background, you gonna get all the you know. All the BST behind the scenes and all that good shit. Interview the people. You gonna talk to the people. You gonna talk to the crowd and shit like that. And that's what you good at. So that's what you part. That's what you. You the, you the leg of the team, but you the crutch. You know what I'm saying? I'm by myself. I'm doing it all. You know what I'm saying? So that's just you know that's just the way I, you know thing. Like boom, you like to do this all right. So we gonna use you this for this part of the team. So now that part of puzzle gone. You gotta find somebody who like to fit flat. So when a flat with target flat, he can fix the flat. So now that part of puzzle gone. You know so on so on, right. man. You got a people oh, to play their part, man. Everybody, yeah. everybody got a, everybody got a purpose. Fucking right. Everybody got a purpose, yeah, man. The smallest purpose, though. The smallest. So as a man, we just gotta keep working, keep grinding, bro. Put all that bullshit to the side. Put all that negative shit to the side, and, and just keep doing what we do. You know what I'm saying? That's it. You hear me? We ain't trying to bring no bad vibes, no bad energy. Fucking right. You know what I'm saying? That shit kill the spirit. That shit kill the creativity. All right. All right, man. We're good talking to you, bro. Yeah, man. Thanks, man. Until next time, we don't, you know. Oh, man. Whatever, whenever, yeah, however, whenever, you hear me, we already know. And I fuck with you because we're in a D, you hear me? Right. We're in a desire project, you hear me, between O Block and, and Marie Dong, and we on pleasure where it's shit pleasant, you hear me? Right. <laughs> we got the Cali, you we going to step wherever, you hear me? Please yeah. believe it. Really we going to step wherever, you hear me? But we good back here, man. It's all love and a D, man. You know what I'm saying? I don't disrespect no nigga. That nigga ain't gonna disrespect me. You ain't gotta respect me, but you ain't gonna disrespect me. So I ain't tripping. Really, yeah. man? man? We in the D with it. We chilling. I Kelly or Mick, y'all. Know them niggas pin the pitch and bitch and we gon' blow the back Tell a nigga bring me back a hundred thousand all cash Yeah, you niggas time, now I'm back, bitch I'm on your extra time and it's my respiration on your G Tell them pussies I be chillin' front of town like a villain I ain't hiding, man, you niggas just ain't lookin' We be thuggin' in this bitch over the stove cookin' the cookie Bet your favorite drug dealer come and book me Now add out, fuck how I turn